guys, welcome to Mom's Planning again. My name's Jody, and this week I'm going to be using my colorful leopard sticker book and my big teacher planner. I'm going to use this, um, like cover these dates up, so I'm going to actually go Monday to Sunday here. So it's August, Monday the 30th to Sunday, 3, 4, 5, September the 5th. So I'm going to use this colorful leopard sticker book. It's meant for a vertical plan. So I'm going to see, I did use... Um, a colorful leopard in a teacher planner once before but it was kind of a different feel so I noticed when I was in here that I had layered some of these stickers this way and I quite like them so I thought I'd just start right off and fire these down around the page um, see how they're layered already and then there's this hello wild ideas oh and of course me and my rip pages there's other boxes that I can use to um, cover up the dates there. So I, I predominantly use these two for Instagram and YouTube. So if I am going to put a box in this section, I like to make sure that um, I've got lots of like a, an actual box that I can write in. So if I overlap this one, let's I'm going to I'm going to do this right in here. So, if I cover up the Instagram just there, then I've got these lines to write in and then I can use these lines for YouTube. And then I'm going to do the same thing, but I'm going to put this right up in the top corner. Is that straight? It looks crooked. I think I had these on wax paper. Oh, it's sticky, guys. Oh, it's <laughs> whenever, whenever I think of that what's sticky the reason I'm laughing is because when my first daughter was born um, every time my husband changed her <laughs> ah, it's crack it again <laughs> he would say that oh it's sticky you know and their first their first baby poo that's too much information Okay, so I'm gonna try and square this up here. I'm gonna I'm gonna move over a bit because I can't seem to do that. There we go. So I always find when I do these spreads that I leave this corner and there's not enough in there. So I've got enough lines here to use for Instagram and then I've got a few here and down here that I can use for YouTube, so that's good. So I'm gonna place this one where do I want you, wild ideas? I'm gonna put it right down here, like so. Awesome. Okay, so the stickers in here are just so gorgeous. There is, let's see, a page. Like, look at those. They're just so rich looking. I wanna stay away from the gold in this spread as pretty as it is. There's those. Where are you boxes? There's some of those, these ones. So I've got a few here. So I've got the blue and the orange and a couple of beige. And then I think I want to bring everything in. So let's go ahead with one, two, three here. And I think I think I'm going to go ahead, actually, and wipe these out. I have a feeling we're going to be able to see through. So I'll wipe these out and then uh, I'll come back. Okay, so there they all are white, whited out. Is that how you say that? Whited? I'll try and square these up. I'm going to put the blue one closer to the bottom so that it's not too close to this box here. Put it right down on the bottom. Do you know what I need to do though? I need to fill in the other ones on the way down so that I can line it up properly. So let's go for a pink and do we want a dull green? What have I got here? Yeah, let's do this one. It seems to go with that one okay. So let's put green beside the orange or underneath it, I should say. My off, my off camera, 
and then we're gonna go pink and then blue hopefully those are lined up okay I feel like this orange one's over a bit but <laughs> that's cute already isn't it so we have what do we have do you know what? It might be cute to bring in some of these colorful washi. I like to just squeeze them in here. Let's grab a couple more boxes, though. What have we got here? I saw a red one. Oh, I've got a... Okay, so these two. A red one and a blue one. That's perfect. Okay. Oh, and another blue one. Is this one gold? No. Okay. Oh, but there's those non-gold that are more of a square look. I'm looking for colors. So I've got, I want to put an orange here and a blue here, but I like this square one. So I'm going to just plunk these. Um, there's a wax paper off the camera there. I'm going to grab this one. And I wonder if I, did I stick the blue into a different sheet? I did. <laughs> it's the things that you do and don't remember, right? So I think I want this orange one. I'm trying to think balanced in this side. I'm going to put it here and I do want, come here blue, I want the larger blue one. Maybe here, I'm going to start it, uh, maybe I'll put it in this section, I don't want it too close to that one. So I'm going to start it up here. It's hard when a sticker is already kind of curled up a bit once you've already taken it off to see if it's straight or not. I, I do struggle with that, see? Okay, let's do my pivot kind of thing. There, that worked. So if I put that there, I'm, I'm thinking of layering something off the side. So, and with this one too, if I use a black sticker, do I have another black sticker that maybe I could layer with this guy? I guess I could use the blue one. I just want black on both sides. So I could use that, I suppose, because these ones have the gold and I don't want to add a gold one. You know, you know. Okay, so let's, huh, you came from there. You're going back home. And I guess with the lines on this, so let's put, mm, so you notice what I see? This has no leopard print spots and this does. So if I put this on this side, two leopard, no leopard. So let's do it this way. So I'm gonna come up this way with this one. And I'm gonna do the same with this one. Ooh, that's cute. So let's see what we can do. I like that. Let's do, hmm. I feel like I could use something down here now. So I do have this blue and this orange that I stuck back down there. Oh, and there's that blue one too. Let's do the washi. Let's see what the washi would look like. Washi. Ooh, we could do a couple of copies too. Um, okay, so we've got, I wanna add these headers to these boxes. So we've got two wild ideas in the plan and we've got ASAP, the plan and work. And these are clear. So I'm gonna to need to white out today Um, 
Let's do this one too. I'm gonna have to be careful though and get it pretty square um, just to cover up this black and I cannot or have this wide out is a pain in my butt. If you push hard enough, he can get it. <laughs> so stupid. All right. So let's do a work and ASAP. And there's a dog barking outside. And surprise, it's not my dog. Ooh, what if we just take this off? That's cute. So I tried to put this blue line in between the W and the O. What if we just cover this one right on top? Okay, let me think about this. Well, I can always, mm, or I overthink, I tell you. What if I do it this way? That's going to look dumb, though, because then it's going to be right in a row. Okay, let's do it. Do it like that. And then do we put the same ones here, but reverse them? I'm gonna have the R and the K coming off, or like this line come between the R and the K for work. And then I'm gonna go this way for ASAP. I should have put the plan on this side. I was thinking I had two of the plan, but. sticker ASAP that fits in there perfect Ooh, that's so cute all right I'm really liking this where's the washi here now what color washi should we go for I think we should do the the multicolor there's like just little bits of ones here as opposed to larger ones. Do I add that to that sticker? It just gives a, a, like a multicolor look to everything. That's kind of not really what I was thinking of, but I was more thinking of covering up these like double lines you know how does this sticker paper rip dare I try it Ooh, that's okay I think I like that better than this I just don't know how this is gonna peel up now oh yeah okay so where can we put this? If I add it here on this double line, it starts into orange. This one, actually what's on my finger here? This one goes a bit into the, into the orange. It's almost like the ready orange, so. And then if I take this one off, see that starting to rip? Let's try this side. Sorry, I probably got that too close. Come up, come up, wherever you can. Yeah. Ooh, I love how colorful this is. This big is so big. I say that every time, but it's huge. Do I have another longer piece here? got these two ends here so what if I what if I carry this on along the same line if I can grab a hold of it and then line up this edge and I think it's light enough that you won't really see the join oh I like that very much Look at this sticker keeps wanting to, I was doing my vertical 
and uh, anyways, lots of stickers. So I need basically, I've got, I've only got three shorter pieces left. So maybe I wait and I've got longer in the black. I'm just placing these little bits down. Oh. Do you know what I do have though? Here's some with a green background. I mean, where am I ever going to use that? There's lots of green in this spread. So let's use this. Oh, it's just not long enough. That's okay. Got more. <laughs> That looks like it's like a duplicate pattern right there. So I'm just going to overlap it slightly. It's hard with these curved boxes. Not hard, I suppose. It just, I, I worry that it looks funny. Um, cutting a straight edge off in between, but I guess it's okay. I can tell that's not straight because I don't see an even amount of curves in there. There. And then I'll just take off the edge of that. Um, if I get another smaller one, let's put these bits back because they're not going to finish that line off. But I might be able to use them for something else. And then... There we go. Oh, that's cute. You know, it adds a little something without overwhelming the page and still giving room to write. Yay! Now I do feel like it's empty right here and I feel like I have this orange box that's stuck here. I guess it's more of a red than an orange, but and I know it's right beside that one. What if I... It's touched down. Okay, good. I just... I feel like it needs... Everything else is layered, so I feel like it's going to need to be layered with something else. And there's those goldies. Oh, there's this blue one. Blue one to the rescue. So let's go this way and then maybe I can do the plan on these ones. So let's center this one down here and I'm thinking about the plan that I want to put on there. So let's go in here. Where are you? I still don't know my way around this book. Okay, so we can do the plan. And I want to actually center it in this one. And that's good. That's darker blue because it covers up that corner. And then let's do, let's do ASAP because then it looks even on the page. <laughs> and then I'll uh, see this here. I'm pulling on both ends to straighten it out and then I end up pulling it out of my hand. So let's just offset it like we do with the other ones. And then I think I'm gonna put a coffee. Let's put a few coffees around. I got stickers everywhere, guys. I was doing, okay, so the vertical one that I just did I put them all diagonal in the center. So I've got little bits of washi and um, corners of stickers and stuff stuck all over the place. So um, that's what's happening. I love these too. Dream busy. Let's 
sees today. Focus. Oh, that's cute. <laughs> oh, I love those hearts. I'm not a big heart person, but why not? I feel like maybe I need one right here. Let's put me time. Oh, love more. Look, it, it was in between me times. I just assumed it was a row of me times. And I'm going to kind of angle it like this. Just to, and maybe overlap both of them. Just to group them together. Maybe me time can go down here. And then we've got a few all around. And then maybe I can put some coffees on these ones. <laughs> That's pretty cute. I'm liking this one a lot. Sunglasses. I put the sunglasses on the, on my vertical spreads. It's a crazy one. Why not have fun with it, right? Right? Right. Do we have all the colors? Blue, green, and orange. So what if we do... What if we do blue? This orange will look okay here. And then put a green one over here. I feel like it's too busy when I've got that green sticker right there covered up. Are you going to come up? <laughs> I better stop there or else it's going to look too crazy. <laughs> I like that very much. It's very cute. Very, very cute. So what I'll do is I'll go ahead and um, I guess write in the um, dates. So we'll steal Lauren's pens. What color should we use? Let's see. I kind of want to go for like a reddy orange. I just, I don't know if we have a reddy orange. These colors are more of a dull kind of color. So I need one that's not so vibrant. That one's too brown. Maybe this blue. Nope. All right, I'll work through this and I'll figure it out. Let's try. I think this green's gonna be too bright. Yeah. I told her, I said, your markers don't match with everything that I have. You need to get new markers. <laughs> She's like, sure, mom, whatever. This seems to tone down a bit though, doesn't it? It turns almost enemy. Which one was that? That was this guy. Okay, let's do it. August to September. So what did I say, the 30th? So if we go 30. Thirty-one, one, two, three, four, five. Yeah, I like that color. Okay, so then we need a pen, and we'll go. So I'm gonna put some. A few layers of paper underneath so that I'm not writing this table is too um, uh, bumpy textured is what I'm trying to find so we'll go Monday Tuesday my shaky hand I like it when the numbers are bigger. The numbers are bigger because it hides all my sins when I 
mess up with my writing. <laughs> Thursday. Friday. Saturday. See, I didn't do the loopy on the D. Okay. And then, so then this is Instagram. This is YouTube. And then this is, um, pictures and Lightroom and then I use this for Canva and this is miscellaneous okay so there's everything written in I use this Stadler they don't they don't tell you what the name of the color is on it but it's um a Stadler brush and then it's got the brush tip and the um the pointed tip on it and then the pen that I use is um 0 0.5 uh, metal tip it's an Energel permanent ink Pentel and I just I just write these in I use stickers down here because I need to cover the dates up and um, I just write them in here so that I don't have to worry about, you know, trying to find other stickers to cover them up. So, and I like to use the smaller stickers, so it saves on stickers too. Okay, so there you have it. Let me know what you think. If you like this video, if you like this spread, give it a thumbs up. If you want to leave a comment in the comment section below, let me know what you think. That would be awesome. And if you want to see more of my videos, hit that subscribe button. And if you want to be notified, hit the bell. Thanks a lot, guys. I really appreciate you watching. Take care. Have a great day.